It's Wired Wednesday, and today we're talking artificial intelligence company OpenAI making big moves into videos. Well, people are returning their Apple Vision Pros, and Apple also officially asking people to stop using a popular go-to rescue method to dry their wet phones. And joining us to break it all down is Abrar Alhidi, video host and producer for CNET. Welcome, Abrar. Always great to see you. Thank you for having me. So let's start with OpenAI because they're expanding with that new text to video feature. What makes this different from Google's other text to video programs? Sora is a very realistic um, platform that can turn your text into video. So anything that you want to see, you basically write the text into Sora and it can create these a generation of either a cityscape or people sitting on a beach or you know whatever you want to imagine. And the thing about it is it looks so realistic. And the, so because it looks so realistic, this is not available to the public yet because this could go south very quickly. Um, they're kind of sharing it right now with experts and misinformation, people who um, you know are visual artists artists and, and filmmakers just to kind of get feedback to make sure that this isn't used to, you know, spread any type of misinformation. It's remarkable to watch the transformation there. Well, let's turn the page to Apple. We're seeing an uptick of people returning their Vision Pros pretty soon after purchasing it. Why is that? It's not surprising just because this is the first Vision Pro that we've seen, so there are going to be some hiccups. A lot of people are saying that they're experiencing headaches or motion sickness. I mean, these are people who are being vocal on social media, so we're not sure how many people are experiencing this. There's also the weight of the device that's kind of front-loaded, so that can be kind of uncomfortable after a while. But really, the biggest thing is there isn't a lot you can do on it just yet. More apps will roll out as time goes on, and I'm sure by the time the second generation of the Vision Pro comes out, then people will probably be more likely to buy and keep it. Okay, this one is great. We all know the feeling of having some water spill on our phones and if you want to dry it off immediately. Some people put it in rice, but Apple is saying that's a big no-no. This is kind of a shock. I feel like we all kind of have always known that you're supposed to put your phone in rice if it gets wet. But Apple is saying, don't do that. The particles from the rice can get on your phone and potentially damage the device. So the best tip is to just time, right? So let it dry out. If you want to tap your phone on your hand to kind of let any of the water come out from the ports and connectors, um, and then just let it sit. Let it sit for 30 minutes. Try charging it again. If it's not working, let it dry for a full day, and then that should hopefully fix the issue. All right.